Well, hello everybody and welcome to Juicy Tingles. Okay, I have a good show for you all today. Happy Saturday. Um, finally, my lotion and my perfume collection, okay? Someone had requested this uh, video, so here we go. Okay? Now, coming up soon, let me just give you a heads up. Um, these are, are my makeup uh, storage uh, gadgets, and I'm going to be doing a video showing you all of my makeup and showing you how I utilize uh, medicine bottles to store my makeup and how I use little cardboard toilet paper uh, rolls, half ones and whole ones, okay? And this is just something that I made with a, I'm sorry, I apologize for that. This is just something I made using some toilet paper or cardboard rolls, okay? But I'm going to show you how I use these items um, to store some of my makeup, okay? Now, on with the show. Okay, so, these lotions that I'm about to show you all is from Bath and Body Works, okay? Now, this one is called Beauty Day. Okay, um, it's a blue lotion. It smells really nice. Okay, so that's lotion number one. Okay, put that right there. Then we have one that's called French, uh, French Lavender and Honey. It has shea and vitamin E in it. Okay, uh, this one does too. Shea and vitamin E in it, okay? So that's that. Okay. Then I have one that's called Thou A Thousand Wishes. Okay. Oh, let me just smell this for y'all. And I know they all smell good, but. Mmm. So. Okay. A Thousand Wishes. Okay. Um, this is a pink looking lotion. And this actually does have like a tinge of lavender in it. Probably on camera you can't really tell, but it's kind of, it does have a tinge of lavender in it. Okay? This is pink. Oh, love this. Now this I have the uh the body spray to go with this, okay? And this is the body spray, a thousand wishes. Okay, so it's a set. Okay. So, that's there. Then I have the next one, which is, this is, uh, it's called Pink Cashmere. Okay? And it almost, um, it almost looks like a cotton candy type color. Maybe like a, a pearl kind of color. Like I said, on camera, you won't be able to see it. But you can see it in the, the thing here. This is, oh my gosh, this smells really nice. Okay. Let's move these up some. Okay. The next one is called Sweet Pea. This is my old, old time, all time favorite. Uh, Sweet Pea has been around for a long time um, with Bath and Body Works. Okay. I always, this is like the all time favorite. My daughter likes this kind too, Sweet Pea. So I'll put that there. This is like, this almost looks kind of white. Okay. Okay. Then the next one is called Pretty as a Peach. Now that smells really nice. Mmm. Ah. Pretty as a Peach. And it's, uh, it's kind of like a corally, somewhat peachy in it. A little bit of peach in it. Okay. Let's just move these on down. Okay, so um, the next one is, now this is one of my favorites, Tiki Mango Mai Tai. Tiki Mango Mai Tai. Okay. Oops. <laughs> Blooper. Maybe it's telling me they want me to put it on. 
Now I'm wearing glitter today. I don't know if you can tell. I tried to go with the theme of um, blue, red, and yellow. That's why I have the blue, red, and yellow scarf all mixed together. That's why I have on the blue lip, um, lip color, which is not a lipstick. I actually used a lip liner uh, to, to get this color. It's a beautiful blue. I don't know the name of it. I've had it for so long, and the name wore off of it. So this is what I did to uh, get my lip color. Although I do have a blue, uh, a blue lip stain called uh, Imperial Blue. But I didn't use this. This is like a dark uh, blue. This is the blue, you know, that I'm wearing now. That somewhat that pretty much matches my shirt. And then I have the uh, red and blue glitters, and then that's where all of my colors come from. Okay, so Tiki Mango. Okay, that's that. And I don't think I can get any more on here. Okay, well, I'll just put that over there. Now, here's one which you got to know this is my favorite because you can see that it's, it's, it's almost empty. It's called Mad About You. So if I had to choose one, this would be the one that I would choose. Mad About You. And I've used this like consistently. And this is like a pink. It's more of a darker pink. Not real dark pink, but... It has more of like a, um, it kind of looks like it has a hot pink mixed in with a light pink. So these two, you can see I've used these more than any of the other ones. Okay. Um, you can see I haven't used this a lot, but I've used it. Um, and I haven't used this a lot, but I've used it. So that's that. Um, and then the last thing as far as in a container like this, this is a bath, um, a body wash called Beautiful Day. Um, and I showed that in the beginning. The lotion called Beautiful Day. Well, this is a body wash. Um, ting! <laughs> um, but yeah, this body wash is excellent and you only need a very little bit very little bit goes a long way and makes tons of suds so I'm just warning you I don't know if all their um, body washes are like that because this is the first body wash that I've ever purchased and it's blue this is the first body wash that I've ever purchased from um, Bath and Body Works because I'm kind of sensitive so I can't just like use any old kind of uh, body wash, you know, in the girly area. So I, I pretty much stay away from a lot of the perfume body washes, but I wanted to try it. So I tried it all over, you know, everything else on my body. Scared to try it anywhere else, but this smells so good. Okay. And you can see I like it because I've used it. <laughs> all right, let's get to these perfumes real quick. Okay. Now I am a person that loves to wear oil. Okay. Well, wait, let me just tell you something really quick about these lotions. Okay. Bath and Body Work to me. Now this is only my opinion. I love the smell of their lotions. Love the smell. But in my opinion, these lotions do not conquer ash. Okay. They do not conquer ash. I mean, you can put it on immediately. You'll see that the ash is gone, but the ash will come right back. So these lotions are not good for ash purposes. Um, they're good just to smell good, in my opinion, but I like to layer my lotion. So I'll put on whatever regular lotion that I use, um, which is Dermacil. And then, you know, I'll layer my skin with Dermacil. And then I will put this on top because that's just been my experience. It does not combat uh, ash for a long extended period of time okay so to me these are just for smell good purposes okay now to the perfumes now I'm, I'm a person that likes to wear body oil okay now these perfumes the only time that I may wear this is when I'm in the house at night time you know just want to spray on something really quick but as far as just wearing perfumes just to go out I don't perfumes don't mix well with my chemistry Especially when, you know, the warmer weather comes up, comes around. So what I pretty much do is I pretty much just use, buy these perfumes from the Dollar Tree. 
and I use them to spray either my curtains in the house or fake flowers and plants just to make the house smell good, okay? I don't use it for the purposes of, you know, trying to make myself smell good. These are predominantly used to spray. You can spray your blankets. You can spray your curtains, fake flowers. Um, yeah, it's good for that purpose. So this is the one that I got. It's called Vanilla Temptation. And they smell really nice. But like I said, perfumes do not mix well with my chemistry. So I don't do perfume. Okay. But I spray it a lot in my little studio slash beauty area. I spray it in my bedroom on the curtains. This is called Only She. And like I said, they all smell really nice. So they're from the Dollar Tree. So I don't know, you know, if you use it on your body, how it's going to work. I don't. This is called Hot Thrills. I would not buy a really, really expensive perfumes, expensive perfume to spray on my curtains, you know, just spraying around my house. <laughs> I would rather just buy the little cheap smell good per perfumes to, you know, spray around your house. So Dollar Tree has plenty of them. This is called um, Meringle. I think that's what the name of it is. Meringle. Okay. So all of these smell good. And then... The, the one body spray that I have, which I only use at night sometimes. Okay? Now, one other thing. I have some little... Some little gadgets in here. I have some sample perfumes that I always pick up when I go to Bon Tons. Um, I go to their little beauty counter and I get uh, samples of their foundation and samples of their perfumes okay but this this is a roll-on perfume called pink dusk and it came with a lotion from the dollar tree okay now these smell really nice okay this is a roll-on uh perfume it smells really good but like i said the only the only way that the only time i use this is for like my little uh, wrist. If I just want like a little um, extra little under under scent. Under t well, whatever. Just a little extra something. I'll put this on my little wrist area. And this is the lotion. Okay. Now this is watered down. This is not for ash. It's, it's just for smell good purposes. So there you have it. Okay. And then I have this. Um, this is called cucumber. This is oil. Now, I got this because, I, I, like I said, I wear all my signature oil is vanilla oil. And I go all the way to Baltimore, where I'm from, to get it, okay? I'm out of my vanilla right now, so I'm having a fit. I got to get one of my family members to send me some. But this is another oil that I ha have, um, and it's in a, you know, it's a roller. It's called cucumber. My husband loves this. And like I said, I just put it right here because I don't like to mix it with my oil. But I just put it right here just to have like a little extra scent. Like the main scent is my vanilla. But then you might can smell like a little other scent. Be like, you know, mm, what is that? So, yeah, that's what this is. It's called cucumber. And then I have my little um, samples, which I showed these on my vlog channel called Eyes Right Now. Um, but I'll show them to you all. Okay. And, it, and they give you a nice little spray bottle. This has a little nozzle on it. Okay. Um. This is called Untold, and it has the same little spray bottle. Um, this is called Jador, same thing. And this is called Olympia. Okay, and last but not least, this is called Angel Moose. Angel Moose. And that has the little spray bottle in it, okay? All right. Oh, and one other thing. This is, um, I forgot the name of this. This was a little sample. Whenever I go to the oil shop, they always give me a sample because I have, I told them, you know, I can't just buy a regular size bottle of oil. I need to have a sample because I need to see how it mixes with my chemistry because some things can smell good in a bottle and not really smell good on you. And um, like I said, any other perf any other oil other than my vanilla, I use for this purpose. So I forgot the name of this. 
Um, but this is a little sample that I wanted to try out that they gave me. Okay. Alrighty, so that's it. That's that's all my collection of perfumes and samples and, and lotions. I hope you all have enjoyed it. Um, make sure you hit the subscribe button so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Make sure you share because sharing is caring. And make sure that you um, check out my other YouTube channels. I have a makeup channel as well. If you like you know, me doing my little colors and, and all that kind of stuff, go over to my makeup channel called Makeup for Dummies. Um, I do have a playlist over there because I do do makeup sometimes in the ASMR style way. So if you go over there, you don't want to go through all my videos, go to my playlist and it'll say ASMR. Uh, it'll just say ASMR. You'll know that I'm doing it ASMR style, which means I'm chewing gum while I'm doing my makeup or while I'm doing my hair. I'm rumbling, you know, stuff around, making, you know, all little noises, trying to find my makeup and stuff. So there you have it. Okay. And I will see you all on the next video. Bye bye now.